what determines how you cry is the image inside if in your mind you have not accepted prosperity as a personal inheritance if you see it you're cried for fear what is faith faith is attempting to do the impossible because god said so if what god has called you to do you can do it god did not call you sir faith is not talk sir faith is action your heart determines your share your heart determines your share it takes a lion's heart to have a lion's share you can have a chicken's heart and have a lion's share. It takes a lion's heart. So the problem is not what they are sharing for you. It's your heart that determines your share. When you approach it with a lion's heart, then you get a lion's share. You've never approached life with a lion's heart. That's why you've gotten chicken's share. Glory to God. Matthew chapter 14 verse 23. So the Bible says, we can start from verse 22. And straight away, Jesus constrained his disciples to get into a ship and to go before him onto the other side while he sent the multitude away. And when he had sent the multitude away, he went into a mountain apart to pray. And when the evening was come, he was there alone. And the Bible says, And the ship was now in the midst of the seas, in the midst of the sea rather, thirst with waves, for the wind was contrary. How do you pray and things get worse? Hey, imagine the only reason why Jesus got into the situation was that he went to pray. Because some of you don't realize that the reason why you get into the problem is that you're just a Christian. He went to pray and the ship moved from where he was and moved to the center of the sea. The Bible says, for the wind was contrary. That means the circumstance of life was against the natural things that were happening in his life. The Bible says this. This is very powerful. The Bible says this. Okay. The wind was contrary. The, yes. Verse 25. And in the fourth watch of the night, Jesus went unto them walking on the sea. Hallelujah. Hey, <laughs> hey. faith has levels see ever look at me there's one level of faith you are praying that the mountain should move there's another level of faith either the mountain is there or not you are moving glory to god he could have said let's stop the wind and they will sail to me he said either the wind stops or it doesn't stop we are going forward that's another level of faith either the wall of jericho is there or the wall of Jericho is not there, we are going to the city. Because sometimes, I, I, I love the way Pastor Chris says it. He says, sometimes when you finish commanding, commanding mountains, say mountain, come down, come down. He said, whoa, come down. It doesn't come down. He said, you know what you do? You just close your eyes. He said, you just close your eyes. I said in the name of, he said, you've commanded the world to come down, refuse to come down. You just close your eyes. I said in the name of Jesus Christ, he said, I walk through it, I walk through it, I walk through it. He said, and you'll find yourself walking through it. Glory to God. Because sometimes when you wait for everything to be perfect, it will not be perfect. Why have you not started the business? I'm, I'm waiting. You are waiting for too long. Brother, walk through it. Why have you not gotten the admission? See, walk through it why have you not gotten married walk through it jesus did not wait for the storm to stop he just walked despite the storm either the country get better or not my prosperity is not negotiated either there's recession or not i refuse to participate in such activities i refuse to participate in coronavirus i refuse to it's a choice to have it say i have it now what do i have must i have what you have and the bible says a man's belly shall be filled with what with the fruit of his lips i'm saying this to you that because of this whatever is stopping you is first internal before it's external and if you have to fix it you have to fix on the inside 